Hi, today we're going to talk about archiving email. Um, based on our system uh, at Quality Trailer, the majority of the people that use Outlook, they use a component in Outlook called IMAP. And generally, IMAP does not necessarily provide a means of archiving email. Uh, there's a little way to trick it and uh, get around the ability to archive. So we're going to go through that process today because right now there's a, a lot of people that periodically get emails saying their mailbox is getting full and they want to keep the emails they don't want to necessarily delete them but they're not sure how to do that so I'm gonna go through the process of, of how to set that up so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna create a data file uh, to create a data file you're gonna go over to the file menu and then once you're in the file menu you're gonna to go to your account settings When you go into account settings, a window will open up, um, and as you'll see, you have a tab called data files. We're going to go into that tab, and we're going to create a new data file. Click on add, and then you're going to give this file a name that, that you know, however you want to call it, uh, Outlook Backup. and uh, you can store this file wherever you want to store it and I'm gonna store mine in my documents folder so then you hit OK and uh, close it and as you can see it creates um, another list uh, or another option in your list right here on the navigation uh, uh, toolbar so if you expand that you'll see you have deleted items search folders and then what you want to do is to say, okay, now I want to be able to create folders under my Outlook backup. So you're going to click your right mouse button and you're going to do new folder. And we're going to give this um, a name. We're going to call it inbox. We're going to say, okay. Now you refresh this and you'll see you have inbox. So now what we're going to do is we're actually going to move mail into this folder. So let's go in here to my inbox. And I'm just going to go down here to some, some old emails that I have. And I'm going to select the first one. And I'm going to go up and I'm going to select, I'm going to hold down my shift key. I'm going to select the top one so I get a whole group of emails. And then I'm going to drag those emails into the inbox. What it will do is it'll move those emails from the server location over to the personal location to that file that we created. So now the emails are no longer residing on the server, they're residing locally within your computer. So now we're going to click on inbox and bam, there are the emails. We still have the search capabilities. Um, so that's basically it and as you create new data files you want to create additional folders they will display here you can actually close this file close Outlook back up and then you have the, the ability it goes away you have the ability to go in back and getting it um, through your file menu so you can go file and then open and say Outlook data file and you can browse back. I stored mine in the documents. You can browse back to it. Say Outlook Backup. Say OK. And there it is again. You can go back and review all your old emails. And those emails are stored in that particular file. If you have any questions or concerns about this demonstration, please feel free to contact the IT department at 817-270-1500. Thanks a lot.